We're around 12 to 13 games in for the Rangers, Devils, and Islanders season. So let's give out some grades on their starts. Joining us now is Anthony Rivera, the co-host of Better Hockey Now, the Better Sports Network on YouTube. Anthony, let's take these hockey folks to schools. Uh, grade what you think these guys or these teams have performed so far early in their season. And thanks for joining us. The Rangers, two wins in a row, four out of their last five. 10-2-1 to start the season. What grade do you give them and why? I mean, the Rangers have been file, uh, firing on all cylinders. They get an A-plus from me. Uh, could not have asked for a better start from them. Everything is working from the penalty uh, kill to the power play. Uh, Atemi Panarin leads the team with 22 points. He has 10 more points than the next Ranger, which is Chris Kreider, who leads the team with goals with nine. And their goalies have been outstanding. Igor Shosturkin, 6-2 and two with a 9-13 save percentage. You look at Jonathan Quick, who's his backup, 3-0 uh, and oh with a 9-3-5 save percentage and then Louis Domingue filling in for uh, the injuries at 962 save percentage they're following on all cylinders and a lot of it's got to go to that head coach Peter Laviolette all right let's talk about the Devils so seven five and one after dropping their last two what grade are you going to give them and why yeah, I'm going to give my Devils a B. They are without their heart and soul of the team right now, Jack Hughes and Nico Heischer. Before getting hurt, uh, Jack was firing on all cylinders, still leads the team with 20 points. Uh, Jasper Bratt and Tyler Toffoli have picked up the slack, but they need Timo Meyer, who uh, just signed that contract extension, and Dawson Mercer, who's looking to uh, sign a contract extension to, to step up. And also their goaltending needs to be better. We talked about how good the Rangers have been. Vitek Vanacek, 8-8-7. Uh, save percentage and Akira Schmid 898 save percentage that's that's not going to cut it on the long haul especially in the postseason in the playoffs they're going to need to step up the Devils have a minus one goal differential and and that's just not going to get it done yeah we're all sitting and waiting for them to go in a midseason run like they did last year so fingers crossed on that one for all those Devs fans out there uh let's finish off with the Islanders one and four in their last five with three losses in a row, five, four, and three to start their season. They got a game tonight. What grade do you give them and why? I'm going to give the Islanders a C right now. Uh, scoring is the problem like we thought it would be in the offseason. Uh, second least goals in the Metropolitan Division at 31, right behind, uh, right ahead of the Capitals, who are ahead of them in the standings. They have 28. Uh, the team leader right now in points is Noah Dobson, and he's a defenseman. You can't have that and expect to win a ton of games. we we'll talk about goaltending, both for all three teams. Their goaltending, really good. Sorokin, 907 save percentage, and Varlamov has a 950. Uh, their goal tending is good, what's going to lead that team, but they need the offense to step up and not just have defensemen leading the team in points. All right, so we've got an A, a B, and a C. Kind of looks like my high school transcripts. <laughs> Thanks for joining <laughs> us, my man. Brandon, always good, my friend.